today we're going to be talking about of how to be a student council. Stay tuned if you want to know how to get it. Take the view. You do? Yes. You're my best view. We're in fourth grade. And running for student council in the fourth grade is an opportunity to develop leadership skills. You get to practice public speaking, design creative campaign posters, and convince your classmates to vote for you with confidence. It's like running for any other office. There's risks of feeling rejected. But even if you lose, you learn valuable lessons that will carry you into middle school and beyond. Just to tell them all the steps to be a student council. Okay, so step one. You need to be yourself, but you need to put a little tiny bit of spice because no one wants to vote for anyone who'd be like, Hi. Okay. You're gonna get looked over. No. You gotta add like some tint of spice. You gotta stand tall and say, say, say Hi! Hi! My name Hi. is Chanel. Hi. I'm in fourth grade and I wanna represent Student Council, Student Council because I am a nice person. I am smart, kind, and respectful. I wanna change this school. A positive influence. I wanna make this school a better school. I want everyone to have a voice. Okay, so next tip. The speech. You want to stand out. There's like 40 kids who want to run and you want to be chosen. Say stuff that you know that will encourage others. And you must mean it too. That's the most important. But don't just tell them and you're not really it. You have to actually be it to say it. So what you need to do is talk with confidence. Talk like you're going to win. Talk like you want to win. You yes. need to win. Convince the audience that you're the one they should choose. To be a good student council, you should have leadership skills. You should also have positive attitudes. And you should have a genuine interest in others. Teamwork, teamwork, and teamwork. Because there's going to be other student councils too. You gotta learn to coexist with each other. You're gonna have to be brave because sometimes you get roles to speak in front of people. Like the whole school. Just tell them your best personality and your traits are. So yeah, if you're funny, tell them that you're funny. If you're kind, tell them that you're kind. Or respectful. Stuff like that. Step two. Our favorite part. Guess what it is. It's the poster. two posters. First one, it says, don't blow it, choose me. It says choose because you chew bubblegum and there's like some fruity, fruity chews okay. and there's a little balloon to represent gum and this is a blow pop. Delicious. And this is a baby picture of me. So cute. So, you guys need to be a little bit creative. Something that someone wants to see. Like, ooh, yeah, I love that. Yep, your turn, sister. And so, my poster. It's from a song. Y'all probably know the song. So, so, this is how it goes. Hey, I just met you. And this is crazy. But here's my poster. So vote my Lani. And a baby picture of me. And a right now picture of me. And a right now and picture of me. One. Guess what's so stinking cute about it? Turn the light off, sister. Mirror me.
superhero on the web. Who's the best vote of them all? Vote Chanel. And there's a little tiny mirror to see yourself. Super duper cute. Yeah. There's the eyes. Believe it or not, most of these stuff were from the dollar store. But the lights, they were from Amazon. We'll try to put the link down below. Third thing to be a student council. Some tips are you can ask your friends what do they want to see different in the school. That will benefit everyone. Sister, what do you want to see different in school? Um, probably. Hmm, good question. More recess time. Yes! More activities and like playground equipment. Because like I played on all the playground equipment. I want like a classroom that can teach kid man kids manners and other stuff if their parents can't teach them. Because some of them kids don't have any manners. So yeah, just different social classes. Oh, and one more thing. We need more Bible study in school. Because we don't even do that. Yeah. Our grandma teaches us Bible every day. And it helps to guide you in everyday life. It's fourth grade, so just have fun. So don't take it too personally. Just have fun. And as we said, if you don't win, there's always another time. And there's other roles you can run for at school. So don't give up hope. That's just a little step. But if you want more details, we'll get into it. This is a student contract that I got. This is my responsibilities as a student council. My signature below means that I understand and agree to uphold the following responsibilities. At, I will act a positive role model for my class and schoolmates by following the behavior expectations of my school, which are known as the five B's. I will keep a positive attitude and always encourage others. I will complete all school assignments and do my best at all my schoolwork, tests, and dismissal. I will have good attendance and provide doctor notes for absent as required. I will attend and participate appropriately in student council meetings. I will complete my assignments, studical duties, or find other members to cover my duties if for some reason I am unable to complete them. Basically, that's my student council contract, signed and sealed. I will do my duty to the best of my ability. Thank you guys so much for watching! Wait, you have to wait for me. Thank you guys so much for watching! Like, subscribe, and you know the drill. Bye guys!